Guys, how's it going? I'm Frost and I'm ready and welcome back to Mass Effect part number 14. Where what the hell was that? Anyway, yes, we're back on Isle. Oh, fuck off. We're back on Ilos. Uh, we started this last episode, there more started. Feel free to watch it. There is a link in the description to a full playlist of everything we've done thus far. If I could actually catch those things, it'd be very nice. There's more, really? Oh, I hate these bouncy things. Right. Is, is that all? Okay, there's a door here. It looks like this is the way forward. It's an elevator, not a door, but... Point. It's still the same point. And we're going down. It's taking us down. Is that a good thing? I don't know. I mean, I suppose so if it takes into the facility. But yeah, this is Sans facility on the planet Ilos. Very close to the end of the game now. It must be running off its own generator. I bet this is the command center for the entire complex. Seren's troops must have sealed the doors from here after he All right, we're going to the command center then. We'll have to figure out how to disengage the security lockdown. If okay, I suppose we can do that. What is with these statues of the creepy aliens? What is with them? They're everywhere. I don't know if I like them or not. They're very aesthetic, but... Oh god, there's more. I don't know why I said there's more that there wasn't going to be. Oh, what the hell was that? Something just took a shitload of health from me. Death crime. I don't think I've fought one of you before. You do a shit amount of damage. And of course it's overheating. Why wouldn't it? That's him. Will you get out of my way, Rex? How are you not dead? Surely that would have like, killed someone from the start. You would think so, at least anyway. There's another one, he's behind there. I think there's another one as well, way over there. Is that all? Okay, that's everyone. Nope, there's another one. I knew it. Where? There. You blend in with that, you know? Okay. That's this bit cleared out. So what now? Do we find like a terminal or something? Or do we just go straight forward? I don't know. We're gonna find out, I suppose. This looks promising. Never mind. No, it's not. Okay. We need to find something else then. I can do that. Then there's an X over here. That's normally a good sign. To something at least. Unless it's telling me to go up. Surely that would that'd be the elevator take me up though. No? Am I missing something? Oh, this is the way up, okay. Hidden, I like it. Security panel, there we go. Come on. Seren's already got a head start. We have to go find him before he reaches the conduit. You're not wrong, but... It's already found it, then we're just walking into a trap. That's a chance we'll have to take. Hold on. Something's happening. Oh, what's this? Too late. Unable to... Invading fleets. No escape. What's, what's happening here? Like some kind of message. But I don't recognize the language. It's probably in Prothean. This recording must be 50,000 years old. No wonder we can't understand it. The message is all broken up, but I recognize some of the words. Oh, is this because I touched multiple beacons? Incredible. The cipher must have transferred an understanding of the Prothean language. Oh, well, that's bloody useful. Not safe. Seek Side of archives. Side the archives? Side the archives. I don't know what that means. Can you make out anything useful? Fault Reapers. The Citadel. Overwhelmed. Only hope. I cannot understand anything this guy's saying. Apart from the bits it's telling me, but it's damaged, so I don't know what it's telling me. Something about the Citadel? All is lost. It said something about the conduit, but it's too degraded to help. We should go. Okay. Don't need to touch that anymore, I don't think. Um, can I go up here? Looks like I can. Don't know if it's going to be useful to me or not, but 
Why not? Doesn't hurt to look. Oh. My people once tried to find this one. Okay, so that was pointless. Um, I imagine we go back to that door then, right? I mean, it's telling me on the map to do that, but that just could be like a thing I put there and just not taking off. But no, it does seem to be telling me to go to this door, so... I don't remember being there before. Oh, it's open now. Oh, what do you know? Touch a bunch of buttons and the elevator doors open. Life lesson for you. Probably shouldn't do that in a facility that you don't know what's in it, especially when it's overrun by robots that are trying to kill you, but hey, you do you. But yeah, we are getting close to the end of this game, I believe, and that's sad, and I still don't know what game I'm going to play next. So if you'd like, you know, an opinion on what that game should be, have we been here before? Oh, we have. Oh yeah, we have. This is where we started. Right, I'm just losing it. But yeah, if you want an opinion on what the next game I should play is, go to my Discord. There's a link in the description. Yeah, link in the description to that too. Can I get in here now? I say yes. Ooh. I thought Saren would have set some kind of trap around this forest. Okay. Okay, so I should look out for that because I don't want to flip the car. I'll keep my eyes open, but to be honest, I'm a bit blind. So, if we hit a trap... Well, if there's a trap here, there's a 100% chance I'm going to hit it. So we're just driving the Mako down this massive corridor. What are all those things on the wall? Some kind of container? They look like stasis pods. The Protheans probably tried to keep themselves... What's that? What's that? All the missiles. Shit. Thought there was like something running to me in the water, but no, it's just a missile. There's another one. Where? Where? I see another one. And there you are. Okay. So they are here. Just remember that. I don't know why I'm saying that, like we didn't know they were here. Is that, is that water? No, it's like a force field. Can I get through that? Or is it gonna like just repel me back? So we've got one chance to find out and wing it. It's a trap. So the answer to that is no. Um, you cannot in fact just wing it. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> well. Um, so this is interesting. You cannot, in fact, wing it. Um, it looks like I'm going to be falling for a while, so I will see you back there. <laughs> oh no! And we're back. What's happening? It's a trap. Saren must have set an ambush. Okay. I don't think Saren's behind this. So now they're on both sides. All right. I don't think the Mako's going to fit through there. Well. It one way? No, it definitely will not fit in there. Alright, we're going on foot. Looks like we need to find a way to disable that then. Another elevator, convenient. So, if Saren didn't set this weird little glitch through the map thing, then who did? Because that's not exactly a normal thing. Saren would have triggered it. What do you think this is? Don't get your hopes up. I mean, Rex is kind of right. Ooh, a beacon. I'm probably going to be able to talk to someone. Vigil. Hello, Vigil. It's good to see you. Maybe, I think. You are not Prothean, but you are not machine either. This eventuality was one of many that was anticipated. This is why we sent our warning through the beacons. Looks like some kind of VI program. Pretty badly damaged. I do not sense the taint of indoctrination upon any of you. Unlike the other that passed recently. Perhaps there is still hope. There's definitely hope, my good sir. Wait a minute. How come I can understand you? Why aren't you speaking the Prothean language? I have been monitoring your communication since you arrived at this Did facility. Did you are the one that took those walls up and made me go at the wall? Will comprehend. My name is Vigil. You are safe here for the moment. But that is likely to change. Soon, nowhere. What do you mean safe. by that? 
Are you some kind of artificial intelligence program? I am an advanced non-organic analysis system with personality imprints from Kesad Aishan, chief overseer of the ILOS research facility. No idea who that is. Why did you bring me here? You must break a cycle that has continued for millions of years. But to stop it, you must understand, or you will make the same mistakes we did. Okay, the was that the end of the course? Your civilization and the seat of government, as it was with us, and as it has been with every civilization that came before us. But the Citadel is a trap. The station is actually an enormous mass relay, one that links to dark space, the empty void beyond the galaxy's horizon. When the Citadel relay is activated, the Reapers will pour through, and all you know will be destroyed. How come nobody ever noticed the Citadel was an inactive mass? I mean, that's a good point. The Reapers are careful to keep the greatest secrets of the Citadel hidden. That is why they created a species of seemingly benign organic caretakers. Hey. The Keepers maintain the station's most basic functions. Oh, they those little frog the things. To discovers the Citadel to use it without fully understanding the technology. Reliance on the Keepers ensures no other species will ever discover the Citadel's true nature. So those little frog fucks, the they're, they're, they're enemies. I thought they were the cool. Reapers invade. The Reapers can wipe out the Council and the entire Citadel fleet in a single surprise attack. That was our fate. Our leaders were dead before we even realized we were under attack. That's a bit sad. The Reapers seized control of the Citadel and through it the mass relays. Communication and so, like, did they destroy it and then rebuild it for the next civilization to come along? Because surely that seems like effort. Cut off from the others. No, maybe just me. Pray for the Reaper fleets. Over the next decades, the Reapers systematically obliterated our people, world by world, system by system. They methodically wiped us out. Some of you must have managed to survive. Through the Citadel, the Reapers had access to all our records, maps, census data. Information is power, and they knew everything about us. And because of those Keepers, now they've got information on the Turians, humans, Asari, and um, Krogan and stuff. Well, would they have information on the Krogan? Probably. They didn't used to be part of the Council. These indoctrinated servants became sleeper agents under Reaper control, taken in as refugees by other Protheans. They betrayed them to the machines. Within a few centuries, the Reapers had killed or enslaved every Prothean in the galaxy. They were relentless, brutal, and absolutely thorough. How can I stop them? You said you brought me here for a reason. Tell me what I need to do. The conduit is the key. Before the Reapers attacked, we Protheans were on the cusp of unlocking the mysteries behind mass relay technology. Ilos was a top secret facility. Here, researchers worked to create a small-scale version of a mass relay, one that linked directly to the Citadel, the hub of the relay network. The conduit's not a weapon. It's a back door onto the Citadel. What happened next? We severed all communication with the outside, and our facility went dark. The personnel retreated underground into these archives. So they are cryopods? To conserve resources, everyone yeah. was put into cryogenic stasis. I was programmed to monitor the facility and wake the staff when the danger had passed. But the genocide of an entire species is a long, slow process. Years passed, decades, centuries. The Reapers persisted. So are there actually profanes in them? reserves were dwindling. You should have fought. We were a few hundred against a galactic invasion fleet. Our own I mean, that's fair. To remain undetected. I began to disable the life support of non-essential personnel. Oh. First support staff, then security. One by so the one, open ones are were shut down dead profanes, I imagine. Eventually, only the stasis pods of the top scientists remained active. Even these were in danger of failing when the Reapers finally retreated back through the Citadel relay. There were hundreds of stasis pods out there. You just shut them down? You killed them? You were programmed to protect them, not kill them. This outcome was not completely unforeseen. My actions were a result of contingency programming entered on my creation. 
I bet they didn't tell the non-essential staff about this contingency. Probably not. I saved key personnel. When the Reapers retreated, the top so researchers So where are they now then? Alive. My actions are the only reason any hope remains. So these... When the researchers key... woke, they realized the Prothean oh. species was doomed. There were only a dozen individuals left. Gonna tell us. I was gonna ask what happened, but... sustain a viable population. Yet they vowed to find some way to stop the Reapers from returning. A way to break the cycle forever. And they knew the Keepers were the key. Aren't they under the influence of the Reapers? The Keepers are controlled by the Citadel. Before each invasion, a signal is sent through the station compelling the Keepers to activate the Citadel relay. After decades of feverish study, the scientists discovered a way to alter this signal. Using the conduit, they gained access to the Citadel and made the modifications. This time, when Sovereign sent the signal to the Citadel, the Keepers ignored it. The Reapers are trapped in dark space. Saren can use the conduit to bypass all the Citadel's external defenses. Correct. And once inside, he can transfer control of the station to Sovereign. Ah, oh, shit. So why are we just standing here? Why, why don't you let me go stop him? Manually open the relay. And the cycle of extinction will begin again. Is there any way we can stop them? That's a weird a data file fuck my fucky little cutscene they gave me though. When you reach the Citadel's master control unit, upload it to the station. It will corrupt the Citadel's security protocol. So do you need to go back to the Citadel? I thought I was banned. Of the station. It might give you a chance against Sovereign. Wait. Where's the Citadel's master control unit? Neither have I, Rex. Neither have I. Through the conduit. Follow Saren. He will lead you to your destination. Ah, oh, we've not got time. Saren's let's go. Got enough of a head start. Grab that data file and let's go. The one you call Saren has not reached the conduit. Not yet. There is. Well, maybe if you, you stop the little teleporter walls, maybe I could actually, you know, get there. Can I take the thing? Do I have it? I imagine I have it. Okay. Let's go then. It's tragic. For all their great achievements, the Protheans lost everything, just like my people. Even their last. Yeah, it was pretty sad to be fair. Alright, back to the Mako. Right, which way are we going then? Then back to the Citadel, didn't it? But to follow Saren, so I imagine we go deeper in. Right? Yeah, because normally they couldn't land, so we have to go deeper in. It has to be, right? Like, I'm not crazy for thinking that. I've also not apparently got my, um. The crosshair for the Mako. I don't know what happened to it, but I don't have it anymore, so. So we're going without it. This looks like a steep drop. Okay. I was hoping for something else, but I suppose I can go this way. More enemies. Again, I don't have my crosshair for the Mako. I don't know what happened to it, but I just don't have one. So it looks like we go deeper into this facility. And then, yeah. We'll save the Citadel next episode, most likely. I'm just going to try and get out of here first. I think that's what I'm going to be doing for the rest of this episode. I genuinely don't have a crosshair, and I don't know what I'm shooting at. So I'm just kind of going fucking blind at the moment. It's one of those big ones as well. And also trying not to overheat at the same time. Nice, I hit all of them. I've got the basis idea of where the crosshair is now, so that's not too bad. Don't let the Mako overheat, and the big one is dead. Nice. Going forward. I don't know how much longer that's been to fight through, but we'll do it. We'll do it. Is hitting any of them? Probably not. Oh, it's hitting some. It 
things. Ah, there's more. Where? Right down there. Oh, I hit one. That's two. And that's three. There's another one. Yeah, there is. Ignore my crap accuracy there. But... Push for... That was like fire. Or is that water again? Please tell me that's not one of those force fields again. I really don't like them. They broke my game last time. I don't know why I said last time. It was like 10 minutes ago. The conduit. It's incredible. We don't have time to admire the view. Yeah, well, I'm trying to move, but the car won't. I'm stuck looking at it. Oh, so this is the Reapers and the Geth are coming through. They're through. They're coming to invade. Froggy Fox took them out. Abandon the Citadel! Evacuate the Council! Citadel Control! Citadel Control, do you copy? Oh no. There's Saturn. Condit closing 40 seconds. I suppose I need to fucking bolt it, don't I? Just don't worry about them. Don't they're not my main concern. Just use it as a ramp. Come on. Nice, gets shot straight into the air because that's safety. Of course, why wouldn't it? Critical failures detected across all monitored systems. Please begin emergency evacuation. Surprise! How did Rex and all that armour fit from under there? Come on now. Tally understands she's small, but Rex, really? Oh, bloody husks again. Oh, bloody brilliant. Yep, come to life. I know how this works. Come on. Alright, I'm gonna talk to the Vina then we'll end the episode, I think. Give me a rundown of the damage. We have lost all primary power to the level. Environmental controls are not responding. Class 3 fires are burning in sectors 2, 3, 6... Well, that's not very good. I suppose what we expect them, but... Are high. I am also detecting numerous unauthorized synthetic life forms throughout the station. They are believed to be hostile. Okay. Come on. We need to stop Saren before it's too late. Please begin... Alrighty. Well, I think I'm going to end the episode right here. I uh, think this is a good place to end off. We'll save the Citadel next time, and I feel like that's going to be the end. Maybe, probably. I don't know if next episode is going to be the last episode, but it very much could be. So, yes, if you want to vote on what the next game is, please do so in my Discord server. Link in that to the. There's a link to that in the description. I don't know why I can never say that. I just can't. But, yes, with that being said, I've been your boy Frost. Hope you guys did enjoy this. Uh, see you all next time for possibly the end. Peace.